Alright everyone, welcome back to Brigandine, The Legend of Renarsia. Let's get into this today. Find my controller real fast and we'll do this. Okay, good. Got everything to go. Alright, so this is Brigandine, The Legend of Renarsia. Welcome back to another Cowboy Brigandine. We're going to be doing this again tonight and... Uh, we're going to try to wrap this up. I'm going to try to put this into maybe a longer stream today. So this might be, I don't know what the timestamp's going to be when we finish, but uh, it could be three hours or so or something like that. But uh, we're going to try to finish up the Mana Celestia Theocracy here. So we're going to go ahead and do that. So let's get into it here. I think I hit all the right buttons to do all the right things. So I think we should be live. Yeah, we should definitely be live. All right, good. All right, so... Let's go ahead and do this. I go ahead and uh, just make sure that everything's synced up. Okay. All right, good. Okay, so I have to try to level up these. Um, I gotta try to level up these little elementals here uh, the best that I can. And um, we're, I'm probably going to put a little bit of effort into leveling up some elementals. So I might do a little bit of grinding at the end just to get the elementals up there. Um, but yeah, that's, that's pretty much all I want to do with that. So we got to take this army on. This army doesn't look too terribly difficult, but it looks like a decent army. You know, they got uh, Frederick Ho here. They've got... They have Sophie, which I wish we had Sophie, but we don't have Sophie, so, you know, can't do much about that. Uh, enough flyers to get around? Possibly. Maybe we should take out the mermaid here. Yeah, probably should take out the mermaid there. Okay. Hey. Yeah. Got three ranges for you. Hey. All right, let's move back one space. I wonder, would it be advantageous to push him into the water? I think maybe I would. Okay, so he's in the water. That could be good for me. Um, it looks like we're all going in a row. Probably take some advantage of this. Probably take a lot of advantage of that. Sorry, Sophie. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Oh, you know what? I should have left her up there a little bit forward. I probably should have done that. Yep. Okay, well, we'll try to make a, uh, something good out of the situation yet. Light spank, didn't do much. Okay, Kane, I don't know if you can really do much, buddy. Oh, man. This could be lights out for Sophie. What else do I have to put in front? Not much else, not much else. I don't think I should go too crazy with that, but I think we should probably knock out Sophie. A double hit would probably work. Let's see here. How far can you go? You can go one, two, three, four, five. You could go that space if this monster was gone. I don't know if the monster will be gone, but we can probably try this. 
So we're in the river. Probably go for a straight up shot through there. Um, I don't know, I got this feeling that that might be a little dangerous. They've got a couple centaurs, some flyers. They could hit me up pretty hard if I put my elementals too far out there. So we'll just shoot through him. Sorry, Torblayan, but um, we're going to knock out Sophie. I wanted to get a double hit, but I also I want to be a little bit safe too because their monsters could literally get across that water. They got centaurs, they've got some flyers. Sorry, little Sophie, but that's, as they say, is that. So we'll get this over here. I think we're close enough for a heal with this. Maybe a holy word. I almost wish I had maybe a little better um, position for that. Put you there. We're going to put... I'm just gonna get the dark dragon all the way up here. Just just put him all the way up to the top. Um, wait, did I send out that enough? Okay, I did. All right, good. Just wanna check on that. All right, so that's pretty good. But um, checking technical stuff every once in a while. <laughs> Let's make sure stuff is working. Um, so many times in the past, I, I start up and I, I go through like, a stream and I stream for like 10 15 minutes and everybody's like you got no audio bro <laughs> so some you know sometimes I gotta double triple check things um, all right uh, we'll see we're gonna put huh I guess there's that should work this thing's gonna take a while to get there but it's it's a tool, it's an option I have. Oh man, I wanted to put something here. Evaner is gonna have to move into better position. He's got really not very good. I, I have to put something here in case they're gonna go and try to shoot this thing down. Um I I guess I'm gonna create a situation where this thing will become the target. Maybe let's try to figure out where to put it to either we put it here or we put it here. Maybe here is better. Even you won't have to move so far. So yeah, I'm out of the blue, but he's kind of being a tank. He's kind of blocking some shots for now. It might actually create a situation where they all try to swarm him, which hopefully he doesn't get too badly damaged. I don't see any super heavy hitting centaurs or anything no super high centaurs uh just they got one flyer yeah they got one flyer they've got the couple centaurs i don't know what this is going to do with damage they could do some decent damage but I, I, he should be okay i think he should be okay well we got another centaur coming in we got this flyer here they've chained my quaddle in place so he's gonna need some healing love. We'll have to see what we can do with that. I guess I should be grateful they didn't decide to focus down <laughs> the the snake that I put in there. Maybe I should be grateful that they didn't do it, you know? Because that, you know, that could be kind of bad. It could be kind of bad. Um, hey. Alright, we've got a weird Got a weird situation, don't we? Um, what do we focus down first here? We focus down first. We go. I feel, I, I kind of feel clogged here. So we've got bees over here. Guess I gotta go north with this. And go north with her. Uh, this might be the better idea. Hey. We'll take down their head. We'll take on take down their tanks, so they can't really do a lot. Should I stay there or should I move? No, we're pretty good there.
either I stay here and heal, which this could work, pop a weakness. Okay, Avenir's got to move. I'd rather get a reposition for a holy word. Um, all right, so let's do let's do a heal with this guy. Okay, good. We got that set. Take our pot shot here with our centaur, which oh man, this would be good position too. Oh, you know what? This might be better position. Let's go over here. Yes, this is great position. Good, good, good. Now I can burn attack through here. That's a bit of a conflicting position with the previous one that I was thinking of. Uh, we could do, if I come over here, would it be safe? Well, not from a holy word. I'd be pseudo frontlining. But maybe it'll be okay. They hit me with a holy word. It's not the end of the world. Okay, so we got you here. I don't know if I should move over. Wait, we're on the bridge? Oh, definitely I should move over. Alright, so there's... River here, river here. I think I want to reposition the snake just one place forward, so probably push over here. Hit this thing. Re get the dragons back in position. The dragon will take the bridge. Uh, we're gonna be okay in this setting, I think. I could even get Kane in there and fight instead. Should I level up the dragon though? This isn't my mana miracle dragon, I don't know. Maybe we should try the dragon a little bit more. Uh, maybe. Alright, I just need to check this out. Dragon would be a really effective against the centaur though, but I'd put it in the water and I don't really want to do that. So, I guess we're just gonna play this position here. Should I breath attack first with my guy? Well, we do have to deal with this thing too. This thing's a problem. Okay, I have... A sort of idea, but I think I need to get repositioned for a holy word. I think that's what I have to do. So I've got to get my dragon over here. Kane will probably have to stay. Okay, let's try to knock out their big bird here. Oh, good shot, good shot. I like that. Good shot. Okay, then I want my angel to move in here. Angel can take an attack on the... On the... Gri well, <laughs> I was going to say griffin on the rock. <laughs> on the rock griffin. Yeah, I could take an attack on that. Um... I want to finish it off with this dark elemental though. Oh, you know what I should do? I, I know exactly what I should do. Let's do this. Attack and away. Get a better shot for the bishop down line. Okay, we're still somewhat in position. Uh, you should basically go for a heal, buddy. Right there. It's perfect. Alright, good. I might 
might have the uh, I might have the audio up too high. I don't know. Okay, I think that's a little better. Perfect. I need to level up my elementals. That's what I really want to do. It's gonna take a while. It definitely will take a while. I was gonna have the angel sword attack it, but it's not necessary. Uh, let's see, can a archangel do enough damage to knock that thing out? Not sure. Okay, so C team's going next. Should I just do a holy word right now? They really don't have much of a team left. This might as well do it. We kind of systematically broke a lot of things. <laughs> we kind of did. Alright. Do I have ranged attacks? Nope. I'm just going to move in. Stand by. Pop a protect. On. Well, what would they hit the most here? But could they or would they hit the most here? That's the thing. Well, holy word, and then they might shoot down my Jaeger Bob. I don't think he'll die anytime soon, but I think he's going to need the protect here. I think that's kind of what we're going to need for this to work. I'm just going to creep him up a little bit more. Man, we're just breaking this army up pretty fast. Holy cow. This army's going to be broken in almost no time. Yeah. I think we systematically, you know, kind of kind of broke a lot of stuff here. It basically was pretty much lights out. Ah, well, thanks for the uh, the brew carrot. I'll have to go get one and celebrate in a second here. I don't know if we got another battle coming up. It's been a couple weeks. <laughs> we haven't we have yet to be on. So I think what we're gonna do here, since I'm just like at the moment, I'm doing like one time a week. I've got some other uh, uh, videos that I have made. I'm gonna be putting them out this week, the end of this week. Um, after today, there will be another episode on YouTube for this here and then we'll do some there's a bestiary and an armament guide so that will be coming out very shortly of course you won I was here <laughs> the new Meligant I really couldn't put a finger on that but I think yeah he's probably the new Meligant there kind of makes sense you know all right we got everybody leveled up good stuff i don't know what's next i forgot last week became a complete bust friend had back issues and i was like oh, it's just not gonna happen <sighs> but this week has been pretty good this week's been pretty good i think next week should be good too Aurora's history. All right, I'm gonna just gonna let this uh, auto play here for all those that want to watch it and see it. I'll let you go ahead and read this.
Hey, no problem. It's a blessing from the rune god without question. In Zai City, capital of Mana Celestia, she watched as countless rune knights paid homage to a fountain of mana all day and well into the night. Reverence for the rune god had permeated every corner of the continent, and with that awareness, Aurora's once broken heart finally fell into a thousand pieces. However, during Aurora's travel, she discovered a place completely devoid of influence or mana power. No matter how hard she looked, she could not even... She could not find a trace of mana anywhere. This place was Death Valley. It was in this valley that a small tribe of dwarves with no ties to the rune god had made their home. The dwarves welcomed Aurora with warm smiles and guided her to the home of a large creature they call the Eater of the Valley. This was the home of the Sky Piercer. This is how Aurora met the Pilum people and the creature they had protected for so long in Dorian. Double dragons, and we got a knight. We got two knights now. We got two knights. Nice. We'll have to send them on quests for the rest of their lives. <laughs> Elixir of magic. I think we got two knights. I don't think I don't know if we got three, but Nanika. Oh, Matthias? Okay. I already know about this guy. The dark necromancer dude. The dark necromancer dude. What's this all about? Is Augustus and Matthias friends or something? As Augustus walked through the town, he heard a familiar yet threatening voice. Dearest husband! <laughs> William, what are you doing here? How dare you despair without a word to your wife? Picking apologies for 17 seasons. I've research to conduct. <laughs> Amelia's rage exploded in an unmistakable demonstration of rune knight power. His powers, how? あの領地には戻らん。まったく。あなたという人は。ならんものはならんのだ。決められた幸せではなく、私は私のお前はお前の幸せを探せ。お前の愛する者と過ごすのだ。そうし。そうか。<笑> Deva, 
いち早く戦乱の世を終わらせて平穏な家庭を築くため戦わせていただきますな何を言うならん<笑>好きにしろと言っているだろうが私はそうしています私の心は旦那様と共にあります何故はお前の気持ちは証明できんだろう旦那様の研究も同じです触れることも見ることもできていない何かを信じ続けて学び続けるそれは愛の心だと思うのですそして私も旦那様に同じ思いを持っているのです同じように私のことも愛してはくださらないのですかわかったわかっただが旦那様はやめろ私をそこらの貴族連中と一緒にするな名前を呼ばないかわかりましたあなたアウグスタス Well, well, well. Husband and wife duo. That actually might be a challenge in the future. <laughs> to just take the families along. Okay, so we got a couple new knights.、Um, yeah, they're down to basically just this. Where's. Bruto. Oh, we killed him, that's right.、Um, good. She is. Okay, we got her up to that. Let's turn up the music a little bit. I thought we were, uh. Oh, we don't have that. We don't even have that totally maxed out yet. Hmm. Welp, I guess we're gonna have to stay here for a while. I wanted double movement. I might go back to the Valkyrie class, but I want the double movement here.、Um, that would be quite. Good to have overall. That would be good to have. Let's see what to do. Okay, this team looks pretty good. I think I'd rather have a centaur in here though. I have too many. <laughs> I have too many horses in here. Holy cow. Too many horse healers.
let's try to organize this a little bit here if we can. Would be nice. Seven. Wait a second. Oh, yeah, that's right, thirty seven. Jeez. Go for a dog. We'll go for a little doggy. Hot dog. Okay, that team is pretty well set. This team's not really going anywhere. Still do some class ups though. Proficiency of two. Got a lot of good stuff on this team. We're gonna have to reorganize a lot of stuff because there's a lot of good stuff here. Might be able to get one of these a little bit higher. We'll have to play with some play with some numbers maybe. But then again. Oh no. Okay for now, I think. Alright, let's do some questing. Let's send these guys over to quest somewhere. Okay, so he's a wizard, so I think we can go quest at here. Melee is a healer. She could go quest over here. Oh, you know what? Actually, I'd rather have them all kind of group up. We'll move him down to here.
Okay, minstrels and archers are going to go to the same place. Sorcerer Conrad, you are going to go down to here. And then you're going to go over here. some questing here too. Wait a second. We get to just have this right off the bat. We don't have to fight the extra stuff anymore because unmap quest is unlocked. I thought you had to do. Yeah, I thought you had to fight the other uh, the questing stuff to get it. That's already unlocked. Okay, that's a lot easier. I I guess all the um, the rare quests are now. Totally unlocked. That wasn't the case before. That wasn't the case in the past. They literally nerfed that feature of the game. Okay. Unless you can quest for them now, and then once you get to the next part, then you can't until you unlock it at the next part. I don't know. Um, but yeah. You can go for the hidden treasury right now without have, having to beat in all the Phantom Knights to do so. I was unaware of that. Okay, so they made a new update to the game that I was not aware of. <laughs> you can just go questing for it now. Unless I never really knew about that in the past, but I'm... I, no. In the past, it was just always unknown. You had to beat these extra little uh, Phantom things to get it unlocked, and it, it makes sense, you know? It's, it's an extra possibility for other treasures, which isn't like ultimately the best, but it's some can be ultimately the best, but um, I think it's worth it to have to do that. I, I, I don't know why they pulled back on that, but okay. All right, so I think everybody's set to go. Did I just double check here? Yep, we're good. All right, let's pop some pop some items eat some stuff, level up a little bit, power potion, yes please, wisdom potion, intelligence up, I'll do the magic here. to give it to Patricia. Patricia is going to be my sorcerer, sorceress in command here. So we're going to go ahead and do that. So we're, we're already set up here, kind of set to go in a way. And uh, we're going to get going here. We're going to knock out this. We're going to be an end game content very, very soon. Very soon. <laughs> Oh jeez. Oh, I wanted to beat this before he Dragon. A dragon. Oh, しかし。今まで見たこともないような天を突くほど巨大な。わかった。すぐにムーは大魔法師に連絡を。地球みんなを呼び寄せて。
ほう旅の娘が一体我がガイムール共和国大統領に何の用じゃい私の名はオーロラエルザウザーラマナの力はもう十分手に入れたはずエリザウザーラ、You have more than enough これ以上はマナの呪縛によって無意味に動かされるに過ぎない。引き返すがよい。Continue down the path you're on and this curse will only consume you further. Turn back while you can. なんですって ?What did you say? やだ、ずいぶん偉そうじゃん。気をつけてシュガー。近づかない方がいいわ。このオーロラって子。なんかおかしな力を放ってる。Better keep your distance. どういうこと What do you mean? さすがバレット族。私の人間とは違った、匂いを嗅ぎ取ったようね。Impressive. I should have known that a Barrett could discern my scent from those of mankind. 人間とは違う一体どういう意味だ Different from those of man? What is this supposed to mean? He has awakened. Who is he? He absolutely despises man of power. Elza Dai Toryo. Anata no Yoni. Amari ni Oku no Mana o Teni de Tani Nyo. Nani Yori mo ni Kunde. What he hates more than anything is when greedy people, much like yourself, present Eliza, have too much mana. What <laughs> Hmm. Pitiful rune knights are a nuisance. Very well. You will entertain him for me, won't you, Madam President? Ideo. Mana ni aragai si pimuru mono nushi. Endorian. Endorian. Battle of Gahar, Gahar. Well, at least I get to pick whoever I want to bring in here. Such sinister power. Everyone brace yourselves. Gain ten XP. Perfect.
Whoa. I have yet to see this attack. <laughs> we shall try a punch. Thirty one percent. Hundred percent. Just tanks all the dance like you can't hurt this guy. Not at this point. Not in this kind of way. You just can't. Mana no chikara ni shibara de shiningen tachio. Ima, sono kubiki o toki hanatte yaro. Endurian! Well, that's it, everybody. Thanks uh, for watching. I guess the game's over now. I have to go back to playing a different file. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> it's like how some Final Fantasies start. They make you lose and that you, you feel like you lost the game as soon as you started, and then, you know... <laughs> I think that's enough for now. Remember, he does not cry out in victory this day. He cries out in pity and grieves over his failure to free you from the Manus Curse. Until we meet again. Well, thanks for the... Thanks for the exhibition. マナの呪縛って一体どういうこと？くそ！大陸統一は目前だったって言うのによ。エルザ様、まずは部隊を立て直さなくては。We should regroup. そうね。みんな元気を出すのよ。Chirp everyone for now. Everyone must return to the center. The threat of Endorian has passed. Okay, so that just skipped our whole attack system, which isn't too bad. At least they didn't get to fight us in turn. Unfortunately, that, that would leave probably Ruto available to fight. Or would it? I don't know. Okay, 1800. Oh, that's right, they can't attack from here. Hmm. All right, so we got two attacks going. Oh, that's interesting. It 
it let us do a, an extra attack. I think I think if they were to update this, just let the attacks roll the way that they were going to roll. Um, but yeah, you just got to redo your attacks. Like, apparently, not a big deal.我らがイムールにはこの戦乱を収める使命がある。マナサリージアのためこの力の全てを負傷者の治療も見落とさないようにしないと。I'm not sure which one of the fights is, this, is going to be harder. This one or the one after this. This one might be easier because they might actually start retreating a little too early. So the next fight might be a little bit tougher, but we'll have to see. And if anybody didn't already hear or didn't know, they're bringing this game out to PlayStation. So PlayStation 4, PlayStation 5, apparently is going to have this. We're going to do some updates to it, uh, change some things around. Uh, uh, Iga said that the uh, Japanese players said the game was too hard, and the American players said it was too easy. Um, it could be a fact, I don't know, maybe there's more American players that are more chess players. Maybe that's the possible case, I know I have been, I haven't been currently playing too much, maybe at some point I'll, I'll get back into that, but I was a pretty good chess player back in the day. Um, but I've been playing a lot of other alternate strategy games for a very long time. And uh, I would have to say... <laughs> I don't want to say good, good, but I mean, literally, like, this is kind of those, this is one of those cases where uh, if you like something, you keep, you keep at it, you keep doing it. If you don't like something, you move on, try something different. I guess if people are moving on and they're not, they're not playing the strategy games because it's become too difficult, then maybe they want to play an easier game. I don't know. It's, uh, you know, it's their call, but. You know, this is something that um, will keep you, um, it'll keep your brain working. <laughs> you gotta get your brain shoes on when you play this game. <laughs> you kinda do. Uh, you sorta do, you know? And see, like that. That's not something you typically would do. You don't put, we usually put the nightmares out in the front. I just, I wanna run a little bit of a oh, test here, though, and see if that thing is a little bit qualified to be there. I'll probably block it anyways, but, you know, just gonna check some of this out. I, d I don't know if they've been doing up... It, it seems like they're doing updates to the game, so they might have changed the way the AI might fight a little bit. Usually the AI is a bit reserved um, when they fight, and they kind of go back and forth. Sometimes they send one guy out, and then they kind of do this, they kind of do that, but they, they seem to play... A fairly consistent gambit when I pit myself against them. Um, Eliza can be out in the front. She's she's good enough. She's strong enough for it. Let's put this uh, Tati arc back there. Dragons take a long time. Can I, can I front line with her? I, I might be able to. I don't see a lot of... Uh, I don't see a lot of holy words, so... I might be safe. In that direction. There we, see, there is a lot of centaurs, though, so I don't know if I want to be... 
too far out with my Okay, let's let's check one thing here. So C teams to go next. Um I guess we could do it. We got backup coming. Yeah, I I would just have to say like with strategy games and such if it's becoming niche, it's just because some players just like really, really easy, easy, simple games. Um, and that can be okay, but I prefer to see more of a resurgence of something like this. We gotta... Gotta calculate parameters. You know? Um... Yep, good luck hitting me. Okay, maybe I, I shouldn't have wished them any luck. Three centers to deal with. Okay, three centers could become a nuisance. Probably have to knock out some centers. Because I do have some things in the front lines. Good, good. Okay, we're gonna take down one centaur this way. Magic attack, finish it off. The other one this way. Oh, wait a second. She's got uh, Divine Ray, doesn't she? Ooh, she could be a problem. She could be a problem. The centers will be two. This thing could be quite devastating if she gets trapped. We'll take care of the bird first. Covered the flank. Flanks well defended. We're going to have some other reinforcements coming pretty soon. Let's see. Who should we halo here? Should we get her? Proficiency of three. It's 700 to go.
I think I have to do a heal. Weakness there. Pop a heal here. Do some kind of spell. I don't know. Maybe we'll hit somebody and sort of back off a bit because I need to not take a divine ray to the face. That's not going to be fun. I could just straight up hit somebody too. Oh, you know what? We're going to do it like this. We're going to do it like this. I'm going to take out that centaur. Yeah, I'm going to take out the centaur. going to have that. I'm not going to have that all day. It's not going to happen. No range to me, please. Thank you. Got a good shot there. How can we set ourselves up well here? Oh. Could do this better than that. hoping it wouldn't happen. I was, that's why I went with the dog first. Uh, he might not hit the dog and then I can move away get the snake in here. The snake could do something that didn't work out. Nice, nice. All right, good. We're gonna have ourselves a very good holiday season here. It's gonna break down all their defenses. <laughs> it's not gonna be this left. Okay, I took out two centaurs, I took out one of their tanks. Wrong target. Oh, jeez. Yeah. I kind of figured. I gotta set somebody up to flank, though. 
I'm doing the holy word. Yep. Yep. Makes sense. Might lose the dog. He got fainted. Alright, what do we got to deal with here? Well, a couple of those guys and a couple more things here, so... Let's see, we got the demon there. Can heal up that dog for me? No, I can't. Might be a good time for a level up. <laughs> I was thinking he's might gonna he might crit this and just like that, boom, there's the crit. Got a Pegasus, not, not too shabby. We'll do a protect here. I want to try something and see if this will work. I don't know. It might, it might not. Close. <laughs> That's very close. Close enough. Close enough. Patricia?
Okay, I think I want the Phoenix to level up here. Can a dog get in and get out and get away? That's a thing. Nope. That's disappointing. that hit. That's good. It's pretty good. Pretty good. Should work. Sorry, Aisha, but yeah. But yeah, about that. <laughs> Got the centaur. Good, good, good. Mina, Nanto Stemo, Ikinobi. Cutta Mina, Kegawa Nai. Is anyone uninjured? It's meaning to say that everybody has been injured. <laughs> Everybody except for one person is not injured. Yay! We got a Pegasus. We have too many of those. I don't need any more. We have way too many Pegasus. Way too many. Way too many. Got the win there. Pretty good. Good stuff. Good stuff. Invasion. Invasion time. Gamul's total combat power is high. Higher than what? We will never know. It doesn't matter because we're fighting this battle. That's why. The Battle of Zai. It has come down to the final capital of the Mana Spring as the final battle for all the normal battles of this game. The Detestable Mohana Knight? How dare you, Kyle? Kane of the Republic of Gamol. If anyone here is a testable, it is the Knights of Zyasect. You butchered a senior statesman. That is a declaration of war. Figured that out by yourself, did you? Well, I guess sending that brazen knight home wasn't so pointless after all. 
Still, matters not how many lives you all give. A man of sex will never be able to atone for its tragedies until it is wiped from history, fallen to ruin Gumol. I see. So that is logic that was brought forward to the And I am proud to have been born in Gumol. Proud to be a Gumolian, and at least I know I'm free. I swear upon my knight, my honor as a knight of Gumol, that I shall rain divine retribution down upon Manislesia. Gumol is kind of like the United States in a way. Maybe, I don't know. I wonder. I thought Morelva might be, but maybe it's, maybe it's Gumol. Okay. Hey. We got Diana here. She's gonna sharpshoot this this little ghouly guy. In the next turn, we're gonna go ahead and do that. Maybe we'll just do it right now. Or not. <laughs> I was like, oh, I'm close enough. No. I'm close. No. I'm, I'm right. No. I'm not there yet. We got, we got like a whole other turn. Or, or, we're two spaces away. We might attract him here. Get the battle started like immediately. Which would be quite good. Gomolian. <laughs> Proud to be a Gomolian. Or at least I know I'm free. That should be our title song for all Gmolian videos. I wish I would have thought about it earlier. And I won't forget. I guess I have to use the statesman in that in that place instead of men. Well, there were actually no, there were a lot of people that died from Zysek because of or not. Uh, there were a lot of people that died from the Moana sect because of Zai. Because of Rudo. Since this is Rudo's mess up here, he's gonna pay for it. With all his. With all his army men. Surrender, I take all your base. I'm gonna crush this thing. There's a lot of bombs here, I, I've gotta be honest. There are a lot of divine rays. Hopefully, we don't lose anybody to, due to that. But I can't be for certain. There's there's at least four divine rays, maybe more. I wonder how much healing power I have here, I don't know. I don't know. I do not know. We got five divine rays. Okay, let's wrap up this section here quick. Gilliam's there. Do we have some healing power? We really, we're gonna have to concentrate our heals. We don't have a lot of healing power really. I can't take a divine ray at this point. Can I heal from there? One, two, three, and if I back up I can. Knock out this thing. Yep, I didn't think so. Oh, wait a second. I've got the nightmare here. That's right. So we can do that. I sometimes forget that. Nightmares in the original game do not get heals. So, yeah. I was just thinking <laughs> straight up weakness with him just right off the bat. Uh... I've got sort of a weak front line in a way. Gotta be, I gotta be somewhat careful here. It's a holy element, so it could handle a divine. It could handle a holy word. So we could probably do this. We probably can.
think we're gonna have to take down the bird here. I think I think the archers need to take down the bird first of all. It's gonna be hard to hit otherwise. Hi. They have skills. I think we'll save the magic attacks for now. on the bird this way. Send in the knight to do what the knight does best. Kill zombies. Or dragon killing. They both, they were both about on the top priority list. Maybe he'll go after the dragon instead. I do have this other dragon here too, but... Oh, wait, 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 wait. Wow, it's only down to seven. You know what? I might just leave the Cardinal to do a heal on the Revenant. If he wants to. And then that way, I don't... I guess I could, but... Good, 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 good. That didn't hurt. Level 20, we could go to Dark Knight at this point. Would be nice. Let's go right about. Guess he's gonna heal the dragon. Unless I get a chance to kill it, then I'll, I'll probably just go for the short up kill there. That's a pretty good thing to do. Perfect. Alright, Abner. This battle's shaping up pretty well. I like it so far. You guys are gonna have to really hold tight this right flank here. The left flank is very strong. I don't have to really worry about it too much, but the right flank... We'll probably come together now. gonna get risky moving forward. There's a lot of bombs waiting for me now. A lot of bombs. Okay, we gotta pop some heals here. The good thing, the good and the bad thing is he's, he might have to move forward with all that stuff, but... He's basically out. He's he's basically done for. I could just knock him out right now. Might as well. Let's put the dragon or let's put the dog over on this side over here. Or before we do that. Yeah, let's do that. Maybe I should bring Kanan to tank a little bit. I do have the Nightmare and I do have the Angel to do some stuff. Maybe that's a better call. It could be a better call. Let's give that a try.
皆遅れるなせい There we go. One guy down. What? Oh no. You had a freaking lapis animus? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, wow. Well. Let's see what you got, Emma. <laughs> Wisdom Talon. What's Kyle got? Okay. Oh man, what a heck of a surprise there. Now I gotta beat down those hit points again. deal with that again. Oh, where to go with you? I don't think they can hit me with any kind of divine rays or any serious spell from here. Perfect, perfect, perfect. We got the paralyze. Very good. Like that. Could go straight up for Holy Word, but I don't know. So far, so good. Uh, they could test this thing to oblivion. That that might that might be bad. I think we're gonna go for heal here. Okay, good. Got that going there. Glad I did that. Okay, he can handle Demine Ray a little bit. Oh man, the Paralyzed fell off immediately. Oh, jeez. Defensive skill. Yes, we need some defensive skills here. Good. Good, I'm quite happy for that. Really? You're just gonna go full bore with that? Okay. Regen on her, that's gonna be quite powerful. He's gonna need a heal, though. He definitely will need a heal. Uh, we need to take out some of these tactical things here. He's... Gilliam's literally out of everything. He's totally useless. No point in even fighting the dude. Our 
right, so this is what we're going to do. Crank out uh, a skill here. I wish I could move one space forward, but I can't because i got to move around. Um, we don't really have to... Well, yeah, I'm going to have to move some things around. Okay, good. Ooh, you know what? I need so many heals on this side, though. Okay, I can reach both sides, both ways. This will be fine. Kane's gonna have to heal himself up, keep himself prepared, you know, all that. Try and knock out these angels if we can. Oh, crit! There we go, there we go. Alright, crit back, eh? Angel down. <laughs> Two angels down. <laughs> Now, if he's going to breath attack through his own guy each and every time, I'm okay with that. Okay, you're going to just sit there and tank, man. You're going to sit there and tank. That's all I want you to do. in the clear. I'm trying to I'm trying to cripple their army as fast as I can here. down their defense. Avener here. Oh, good, 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 good. Yes. Yes, we can Geno now. Maybe even Holy Word, too. Oh, well, yeah, he's only got Holy Word, so I guess that's what we're doing. 
I guess that's what we're doing here. Give it to the guy that might get hit. I don't know. He might send... Well, he can only really send the bishop in here to, to attack him. I don't think the bishop will take off 200 hit points. I mean, Gilliam's pretty bad in a lot of ways, but what is this attack like? 108, strength 72. It's, it's not terrible. I'm not a dark elemental, though, so... I don't think he'll do 200 points of damage on me. I, I really don't. Uh, let's give it to... Good old Kane over here. Let's see, what can we do? Holy words from here? Maybe holy word would be a good option. Yeah, we'll hit all the leaders. Hit all the leaders. It's a good idea. Oh no. I found my weakness. I think the dog was kind of screwed when I, when I could move him three spaces away. I was like, no! That's not what I want to do. Guess he did have to move a little too far there. <laughs> oh man, he's getting lucky. Three hit points on him. Poor, poor hot dog. He will be missed. Oh, you move one space out of the way, you jerk. What could I do? I guess I'm just gonna move up here. Probably should take out the dragon now. I think it's about time. I mean, I could probably take out the angel too. Maybe I'll take out the angel first. No more loop heals. That's gotta go. Angels on Kyle's team. Kyle can heal. I don't think I'm taking out Kyle right now. I think we're gonna focus on the dragon. He did his two shots too, didn't he? Yeah, he did. Let's make this a little more special. We got some MP in reserve. Might as well go. Right there. Um, out. <laughs> I might have to just take out the leaders. Just focus them down, I think. Yeah, I got no more magic with my my little uh, elemental guys, so I guess they're out. I mean, I guess I could sick him on here. That would kill off the dragon, that's for sure. Ooh, that was a good crit. Yeah, he's he's gonna be very low now. Good. Good. Mm 
Level 20, I like it. Uh, we should just start moving in right now. It's about time. Fence up there. Good stuff. Gonna make some good progress here, I think. Need to get a healer right about here. Oh, and he's like, he's kind of clogged. He can't really go anywhere there. That's okay. <laughs> They're all very much on the brink of destruction. We might be able to break every single thing in our army, I think. Possibly. Okay, looks like we're making broken turns here now. Um, would you look at that? did it we did it everybody so thanks everybody for youtube for being here please hit the like and ship uh, like and shub share button yeah please hit the like and subscribe button uh if you would that would help me out very much so i would very much appreciate it um i could try yeah it's jaeger bob jaeger bomb is is too weak is that jaeger bomb or jaeger Jaeger Bob. Oh, I couldn't fit the M, could I? I think that's why I did that. Yeah, I think that's why I did. <laughs> what do we got left here? We got Kane here. Divine Break. 77. Might do a massive amount of damage to her. Give it a shot. Oh, with a crit on top. The cherry on top. No way. Oh, it's number 77. That, that, it's a good number for that. Ah, and he had to heal up too. Big jerk. Alright, we're gonna start off with this first. No, I can't. I can't, I, I can't use them right now. They're just too squish. They're too squishy. It's too squishy. I, I just have to say, it's just too squishy. It's just the way it is. It just is. It's squishy. It's, it's squishy. squishy. He knows it's squishy. Hey. It really is. It really is. Okay, back to seriousness. Let's pop a weakness on Mr. Kyle. So he can't, he can't, like, you know, do too much to us. He can't break us down. Hey. Well, she is blue. Might as well add a green dot to this. Let's, let's do it right. <laughs> Sorry, Emma. Wisdom metal acquired. Good stuff. Level 20. Ah, oh, I can't do much with you. I'll try to surround him now. There we go. Can you do any spells, bro? Got a flame spell. 
could do with you, Avner. Kind of figures, kind of figures, you know. Okay, so my guy goes first, so we're probably going to be able to do something pretty good here. Turn 7. Basically almost completely annihilated the whole team. I think we literally did. Quite literally. 54... You know what, I, I don't know if I'm bringing Kane with me into any serious final battle, so I guess we'll start up with the attack first. Oh, jeez, he'll flat out kill the dude. Why is that? Do you have a dark sword? Oh, no, no, you got a red sword, that's right, you got the, the red blazing sword right there. Defensive skill! No! Oh, I should have put him down one more notch. It's okay. We'll we'll finish it with this, with sugar. There we go. There we go. Of course we won. I was here. Yes, yes, Kane. We know. Thank you. Thank you, man. You were here. You were here. Definitely were. You're a big part in the battle. Really were. Okay. So. We have more to do. <laughs> Much more to do. What is it? It's a 10, right? Holy cow. So. Is everybody else in the chat on Twitch? Thank you for being here. Hopefully you're having a good time. Hopefully you're having a good night. Um, we've got to do a little bit more. Manislesia Theocracy was erased from the history of Renasia. Obtained the sanctity Manistone. After the fall. Renersia, year 781, season 17. The Mattis Leslie Theocracy was erased from the history of Renersia. During the collapse, the ruined police led by Rudo was also disbanded. And just like that, the confrontation between the two sects of the ruined faith, the division responsible for so much spilled blood, came to an abrupt end. The coming days saw many nights of the Zai sect converting. Rudo went unseen for many long years after the fall of his country. That is, until one day when his corpse was discovered on the ground in front of the Zai city's mana spring. Though he was given a funeral befitting his position as former ruler, stories say that even after being cremated, his hands still grasped the hilt of his knife that had killed him. The hilt of the knife that had killed him. Interesting. I wonder who that was. Here are the news. President's on successful conquest of Renarzia. However, the end of the war meant that it was also time for Eliza's infantry to go separate ways. Thank, I cannot thank everyone for all your hard work. I'm not going to actually let this go ahead here. Okay, 
何言ってるのムーアにはこれからも大魔法師として私を助けていただかなくちゃならないんだから元気でいてくれないと困るわそれはどうかなおじいちゃん時々呪文唱えてるうちに眠っちゃうことあるからねぼちぼち孫に大魔法師の座を譲るべきかもよほらまたお前は<笑>わしの職を奪おうとしよう<笑>カイン今日は大魔法師の座を譲るべきあなたがいてくれてとても心強かったよ<笑>俺はルーンの騎士として務めを果たしただけさエールザお前が大統領にふさわしくないと思ったら直ちに罷免動議を提出してやるからな<笑>相変わらずだなお前様そう悪口たれたるな戦場ではよーくウルザ様の援護をしとったじゃないか本当本当エルザお姉ちゃんを助けるためにすっごいモンスター召喚してたもんね<笑>まバカだからそれはガイムールの騎士として当然のことをしたまでだと<笑>おれまあカイン大統領補佐官様ほっぺが赤くなってますよーだ<笑>ダリアンはあれいつの間にか消えちゃってる<笑>苦手なんですよお礼を言われたりそれにお別れの挨拶をしたりするのがそうケイトそれではダリアンにくれぐれも伝えてくれないブラックバード隊はもう今までと違って一級の舞台に格上げルーンの騎士として生きるもあんまなを飲むのをやめるのも自由エルザ様ようやく皆の働きでお父上の念願であったバレット族の自由が実現しましたな Slice with everyone's help, you finally fulfilled your father's wish of setting the Barretts free. The Barretts get freed here. So, Eliza's the、uh, Brigandine's Abraham Lincoln. Holy cow. Wow. That's amazing. That is pretty cool, actually. That is pretty cool. Ich liebe. エルザ様ん私考えてみようと思うんですケイトエルザ大統領の宣言で我々バレット族は自由を得ましたでもそれは同時にこれからは全て自分たちで考え判断し決断しなくてはならないことでもありますそうねですから少し時間をかけて考えてみたいのです私やダリアンのような一族にとって一体どういう生き方を選ぶことが本当の幸せなのかうんそうね本当にそうだわ All the time you need. Eliza could, not help. Eliza could not help but think about how Kate's words could be applied to her own situation as well. Though she had followed her father's wishes to take over the presidency after his death, she had begun to wonder whether this is really the path she wanted to take in life. Ooh. That night, Eliza danced. With the nation fast asleep, the only sounds to be heard were her. There was another sound that she could hear, and it was a sound of. 
I can't read that fast. <laughs> it was a haunting melody played by Music Guild, an endless dance across the floor. I guess she's thinking of maybe just going back to dancing, maybe. This president, Elza Uzala of the Republic of Gamal, became steward of Renarizia, ushering in a period of peace and prosperity. So it's saying before a true era of peace could begin, there was one final battle to be fought. After President Eliza, Eliza had unified the land, the inevitable had finally reared its ugly head. Rungad released a fearsome bolt of lightning upon the land of Renarizia. Rungad likely cared little about what formed the tower. All I needed to demonstrate is absolute power to those who dare defy him. The region of that, that of the Republic of Gamal, there remained a symbol of the rune faith, a statue of Mahana Karadine. It was into this form the Rugad poured all his power.
The Silza. Man of Celestia Theocracy has fallen. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we already know about this. We just did it. <laughs> we already know about that. あたしはアイシャ。この大国を滅ぼすなんてあんたの国の勢いは本物だね。そんでもって私も大家族を食わせなきゃなんなくてね。あんたのこれからますます戦いも苛烈になってくだろうさ。そういうわけでやる。Okay, cool. We got her too. Death Valley lies north of Zagust. It is here that the destiny of the land will be decided. When the rude god descended, it negatively affected the mana covering the land. Rumors began circulating of strange phantasms of monsters and knights appearing in areas unaffected by this distorted mana showers. Great rewards await anyone who can restore the peace of these lands. Lands affected by chaotic mana can be invaded via quests. Select the base that has been overrun with distorted mana. Then you can select dispatched locations. I already know about that. If you want to read that, you can. There are some guides out there. It's quite simple. You just send the knights on a quest to the location you want to fight. Send three of them there, and it counts as a sending them into battle. So, all right. So we are here. Literally have the whole world conquered except for Death Valley. Uh, we do have these quests to do here. I don't know if anybody wants to see this or not. Doesn't. I guess you know this is just like extra quests you can do. Um, I don't know. I was maybe considering doing this and maybe doing a live, but maybe what I'll do is maybe off screen I'll do all these battles, get through it, see how high I can get my knights to, and then next week we'll come back and we'll do the final fight. I think maybe that would be a little more fun. I've already gone through basically all the uh, the quest fights as it is, and uh, the last last LP I went with uh, Mana Celestia Theocracy and I grinded like crazy so I spent way more time in a game than you even need to and I got Rudo up to basically max stats with strength and stuff and he was insane and uh, he was really powerful like, super powerful and a couple other characters too so um, you know if you want to check it out here I've literally you know, close to each season, I'm going to move to a new location, do a quest attack, move to a new location, do a quest attack. So maybe by next stream, I might be done with this. Um, <laughs> Odila, Odila. How's it going, Vertigor? How you doing, man? Yeah, I was thinking about doing some of this and saving. I might do maybe, would you want to see one quest fight? I, I might do one quest fight, but I think I'm going to... Uh, you know, call it after that. If you want to see a quest fight, we can do it, but other than that, um, we'll probably wait until next week to do Death Valley, and then Death Valley next next week, we'll just do both fights in a row. So, we'll... I'll have to try to cut that up for YouTube if I can, but, um... Yeah, we'll have to do something like that. But, um... We'll send our main team of which I don't really know what I want for the full main team here. Might have to grab some of these monsters here. So I think, um... What's that, man? Doing good. I completed the night list already. I was missing the idols. Killing the rune god. Okay. Yeah, yeah. You gotta do, you gotta do both scenarios uh, here. I think what we'll do is we'll send all the main guys over to one castle and we'll do one of these quests here. I think we'll do uh, we'll do this one to start because I like to do the I like to do the corner ones to start. We'll get back to the middle, but um, just grab them all. Move over there. I'll be doing some questing in between time. But I'm not going to overquest, so I'm not going to overdo it. We're just going to get as high as we can from these battles themselves. 
and whatever we can get from the quests themselves. And so the time frame might be whatever it takes to, to totally clear out these little phantasm battles. And, uh, you know, I'll do the Zor thing as well. I don't know if I'll do it for the YouTube thing because I've already beaten it the strong, the fastest way with Rudo by himself. One man army video, Vertigor. Go check that out on YouTube. Uh, literally took took uh, Rudo against the Zor illusion by himself and I flattened him out. <laughs> I laid out that monster. Well, it was a little risky though, but I, I took out all the knights. Um, didn't kill every monster, but I had to kill some of the Fenrirs. But then I got, you know, took out the mate. That was a fun fight. That was a fun fight. It was definitely a lot of work. It took me... It took me a solid week. It took me a solid week, and I kid you not, a solid week of grinding quests just to get the items, just to level up the strength. You know, all you gotta do is get his attack up to 999. That's it. You don't have to get his strength up to 999. Just his attack. That is it. And then Rudo will literally flatten anything. I, and and also I, I granted to get enough MP so like he could do his uh, clean military rule as many times as possible. I think it's 920 MP you need to do four clean military rules. And you needed every bit of that. I, I, I think if I wouldn't have had a clean military rule, I might not have done it, but uh, that could be debatable maybe. But... Um, yeah, one man army. That guy, that guy alone. I don't know if other knight. I don't know if another ruler could do that. I don't think Stella could. Stella's got a pre-move with dragon's destruction. Maybe. Uh, I don't know. Tim maybe. I don't know. Eliza maybe. <laughs> you were trying to write Tim and it autoed it to team. <laughs> Tim with Tim with benevolence. I don't know. Maybe. We'll have to look at it. I'm not sure Eliza... I'm not sure Elza could do it. I, I I, wish... I wish. I really do wish. But the fact is... The reason I thought Ruto could do it is because of his power. Just his raw damage power. She's got 135 for natural attack power. And then she goes to Clim Crimson Rondo is 180. But uh, Clean Military Rules is 290. 290 power for Clean Military Rule. It's, it's almost like he needed to have it. I, d I don't know if Crimson Rondo could do it. I, I just, I'm not sure. Maybe at some point I might challenge myself to do that, but um, nah, we'll, we'll leave that for another time. Maybe when I do some more challenge modes uh, in the future when I do challenge for this. So, you know, what you know about me is that uh, in the past with the Grand Editions, I, I accepted challenges to play the game through because, um, I don't know, it's just more fun that way. You know, so in the future when I do the challenge stuff, then we might do some extra stuff with that, you know, but. All right, so we got all those knights going over there. Gonna to continue to quest a little bit more. I mean, possibly I, I haven't really worked with Tim too much, honestly. I've just fought against him most of the time. So, you know, if you want to see Gustava next, definitely vote for it. The next LP up, I'm gonna make a voting tally for the Bring Dean Engine site and for um, my section of Discord. And um, maybe even in the, the Discord and Bring Dean, I might even put it on uh, Reddit too because I'm the main guy for Reddit there as well. Um, so I might put it there also. I might put a voting tally there. But I've got HGE, Shinobi Tribe, and Norzalio left. So that, that could be voted for. I, I don't know, maybe people will vote for Norzalio. <laughs> Who knows? Who knows? You just joined the uh, Discord engine, but you don't, which don't check too much. Well, I'm I'm on there every day, every other day. You know, I've I've got a lot to do as well, so I don't always get to both sites. But when I do, I'll leave a comment if I see something interesting to talk about. Um, 
but you know if you if you have any questions with uh, Reddit, you know definitely DM me on Discord or on on Twitch or uh, maybe maybe Twitch, not Twitch. Um, uh, DM me on uh, Twitter. Twitter I I check almost every day, uh, just looking through something. Especially if I put up something, it's it's easy to check that. I'm not always checking Discord, so sometimes things fall to the wayside in Discord. Uh, but <laughs> yeah, so so we've got. This, this is interesting. They changed this whole thing. Check this out, man. Oh, you know what? He's only at level 8. He needs a training grounds. Um, you can... Now, I know I'm showing you this now, but before you get to here, before you conquer the whole world, if you took over a capital, you can quest their rare place now. It's not rare anymore. So you can quest here at the Forgotten Cliffs before you even beat the game. They changed that. They they sort of nerfed that. I I think I I'd have to say I kind of liked it the way it was. It made it a little more rare. Now it's just like a normal location. Um, I I don't know why, but okay, you know I guess I guess we can go for that now. Which it, I guess it does make the game a little bit easier in a way because you know you don't have to wait to beat the game to start questing for some of this stuff because some of this stuff is a little bit too rare to find. And if you don't get it before the end of the game, then you're just not, you, you can't access it to fight against other players, or not players, but, you know, you can't use it in the normal scenario of things. So, I guess I understand. I guess. Oh yeah, she's an archer. Oh yeah. I gotta divvy them up here. Dragon Springs. Oh, is this the first time you've beaten through the first playthrough? Okay. Okay, maybe I mixed that up. I thought it was I thought it was only accessible after you get to the quest scenario here. I thought that was just the way it was. Um Maybe it's not an update. Okay, so we got that. We got a quest here. Alright, seeing as how we're just kind of going for the boss, I'm not going to do a bunch of leveling up or anything. It's just going to be whatever the time frame is here. It's going to take me, I'm literally, when I'm going to be doing these fights, I'm going to take my end game team. So what you see me taking here is probably going to be my end game team and I'm going to move it from this castle to this castle to this castle and then we're just going to fight with one team over and over and over again to level them up as high as we can so then when we go and fight the, the last fight we're, we're good to go. So I'm not going to send every team to fight all of them all at once. I'm just going to like not how I did initially if every team is fighting all the time just one team's going to fight each and every single one until it's a light blue color and then we'll go on to the, the final thing when you beat your uh, first playthrough it includes everything clearing all of those but yeah so it does that okay hey Mr. Goldark hey it's been a while how you doing finish uh, Silesia it's my first playthrough thinking it would be a Scarus level difficulty Wise, but it was essentially just Rudo smash. <laughs> Not having Rudo around makes my Goose of a playthrough a bit more challenging. Yep, yep. I'm, you know, I have to say, I have to say, it's very much like that in a lot of ways because um, Mana Celestia, country wise, story wise, nation wise, knight wise, position wise, color wise, almost everything is perfectly identical to uh, Ascaris Empire, a Zemeckis run from the Grand Edition. Almost identical. The uh, only difference is you don't have a crossbow. You know, <laughs> you got like terrible knights that aren't all that good. You've got like a handful of really powerful knights like Rudo and Emma and Kyle and uh, I don't know, maybe like Vader or something like that. 
it, you, you have a handful of super powerful knights like you have in Grand Edition, like you have with Zemeckis, and other than that, everybody else has got like terrible rune control, terrible rune power. You got Gilliam, who's literally the new Langoborg. It's you, you got to be careful where you put all your stuff. Um, but yeah, you can literally send Rudo with one other knight or by himself against the whole team, and yes, Rudo smash. He could do it. Definitely can do that. Um, but then the other teams, you got to be a little bit careful about because you're all spread out and. You know how Mana Celestia territory is. It's a rat's nest. It's it's kind of like how you're playing with the Scar's Empire. You got to defend too many borders. It's it's really tough. So, all right. So I think we got everything set. Let's go ahead and uh, put it over there. Okay, we can't attack here, so we're just gonna go ahead and continue from here. Get a quest knights back. Oh, nice, nice. I wanted to get some, this is perfect. This is exactly what I wanted. I want to get a, like a whole team of elementals and send them into the final fight. You don't have Saraha. Well, you sort of do have Saraha with Tim. Tim is sort of the new Saraha. I'd have to say if anybody was like the Ninja Master guy, that's him. Because he shoots stuff from a two space distance and he runs away. He's like the Ninja leader, which you'd never had that before, you know? It's like they got rid of the Vinard character and they made Tim the the Dusharaha the way, you know? Except for he doesn't have lightning bolt attacks, which I kinda miss. Oh, on mana? Okay. Yeah. Seven stars cutlass! Oh, we're getting all these great swords and I I got nobody to give it to. They said Darien went. Is he still here? I gotta look for him. Oh yeah, he's still here. Oh, he just left the party, that's all. Okay, so we gotta set up our final team here. I'm gonna get uh, a dragon here. Get two dragons. Oh boy. So I'm going to do a little organizing here. Fire Elemental. Should I take Kate? Maybe I should take Kate with me. Trying to figure out if I should take Kate. Maybe. Kate or Diana? Challenge mode? Then it keeps giving me a magic potion. I just want strength or. Or attack. That's interesting. I wonder why. That's pretty interesting. I wonder why I'd do that. Hmm. I almost want to go in with a bunch of centaurs, but... Maybe I'll leave that for Shinobi. Oh, I wanted all elementals. That's what I really wanted. Um... <laughs> you Sylvie, come on. <laughs> Is she right here? Do I? Do I? Oh, I do have her. I haven't bothered to level her up, though. So she's, she's not... Um... Get fed up with, with uh, Della. Oda Della, Oda Della. No, I don't get fed up with that. I like that. Maybe we could use her. Maybe we could go with some archers or something. Maybe we'll go for assassins with Shinobi and we'll go for archers for this for this team here. Um, if that's the case, then we'll go with Diana. Not the greatest with control, but... 
Hello there. <laughs> How's it going? Yeah, I don't know if we have a sexy hello. Do we have that still? How's it going, Altison? How you doing, buddy? <laughs> okay, we're gonna try to build up elementals. We might need some healers, though. Got a unicorn here. Okay, I, I don't... Oh, yeah, I could. I could. I could get, uh... Could get a good juicy pegasus in here. But we gotta find a good one, though. Or... Or... You know what? Pegasus would be better, because we might be able to just pop a halo and something. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, thanks for stopping by, Altison. Uh, we're gonna do a battle here, and then, uh, I don't know what else we'll do. Could go with just a ton of centaurs. Centaurs and elementals. Wait, where... Where's that other dark elemental? We're gonna have to get it in here. We found a new dark elemental, level 10, that just popped into our... Popped into our team somewhere. Yeah, we could go with Diana and and Sylvie. Got the two dragons. We're gonna have to build them up with something. I don't know if we can get an ancient dragon, but probably get some equipment there. Okay, if we're gonna bring that too, we're gonna have to do something. You know what? I'm gonna need some healers. I just am. Could go with a phoenix, but the way this team is composed, I think this would be better. Dancer type. Oh, we could go full assassin too. Holy cow. <laughs> On them four locations, there's a map that annoyingly has archers and centaurs. I cleared them with two to three meter dooms. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's a tough fight. That is a tough fight. Uh, green or red characters going in there would be best. Um, I tried that with Raging Paul, and he just wasn't having it. <laughs> he just he was like, no, I'm not fighting that ever again. I was like, dude, it's not... It's it's tough, but it's not impossible. And we just... We didn't get to do it. So, yeah. Alright, we'll have to readjust some things here. Ooh. Yeah, they do. They are. Maybe I'll level up this this um, angel here because it's already a man of miracle. Maybe I'll focus that down. This is my, one of my original serpents, I think. <laughs> and we were leveling up this little goblin man too. Might as well put him into into the fray. Tough Jack. Iron gloves. Power medallion. Ooh, white defense.
right, she's set to go. Quest out the other ones here. Temple, temple. Deepest jungle. Alright, we got too many people here. If only we could quest her out, that would be nice, but... We could do a little, uh, training grounds. I'll have to readjust this later. We'll just... Oh, nope. Might not get a lot from here, but I need to readjust the monsters. The monsters in the nice. I gotta figure out who I want to go send where. You need to level up, bro. <laughs> level five. Ah, uh, level five. End game and you're level five. Okay. Okay, sorcerer. You know, actually, you come over here. some training grounds, bro. Isle of Seymour. Okay. We're good to go. Let's do it. Assassins plus archers spread out a lot. Like the melee guys. Okay, we're gonna try this with Kate. I mean, uh... Sylvie, sorry. Keep thinking her name is Kate, I don't know why. Yeah, how's it going out, Sin? Vertigore. I don't know if I asked you that tonight, but... Looks like we got a uh, pretty good wand. Volcano wand's pretty good. Power pill. Love to have those. Light hatchet. Oh, we finally got a bow. Great. I'm gonna have to quest some places where I can get a bow. Because I'm gonna go with two bow users, I think. We have so many swords, too, you know? When you hear her, there is no doubting it's her. Starting tomorrow, a new country right. Well, not tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow is going to be the alternate chapter. So we're going to have some good friends here. Raging Paul and Metallic Mike are going to be here. And we're playing the alternate chapter. So we're playing Morelva. And I'm walking around with one knight. I'm just walking around with Stella with like two or three monsters. And the enemy doesn't even bother attacking me. I'm just too powerful. Just Stella. They're just, they're, they're freaking out. Run away every time I get close or I have to go into battle with them and, uh, you know, kill their leaders off. And then the last leader is like, hey, did a good job. I'm out. <laughs> they leave. They leave. <laughs> That's okay. But, uh... All right, so let's do... Maybe we should start moving them around the map. Darien, a Dark Knight, should go to... 
I think the planes, but we gotta go for... I think Shumli is with the planes here. I could probably... Maybe Drogon? Where, where's the bow at? I think... The bow... Oh, I need a samurai for that. We'll go over here. Assassins can come over here. I did so much questing, I almost, like, know exactly where to send them now. <laughs> like, I almost kind of know all the places on the map. I, I might not remember everything perfectly, but... Uh, a healer... St. Gladia, or the one just above that for healers. Rogues. Rogue, mage, sorcerer. These are really good places down here, um, I swear. Ilvany and St. Gladia are some of the best. Balutz also has the same thing as St. Gladia. Um, you know. Alterna for healers? I think so. I'm just gonna mass quest in one spot. It just makes it easier. I don't have to click on a bunch of stuff. Uh, I have to look at where I've gotten everything from. I actually wrote down a list. I actually have one of my videos coming out soon of where some of the items are, and I've, I've got this paper here that I've, I've had for a long time. Ancient Gauntlets, uh, Mount Madrol, or the Peaks of Maydell, um, as as far as what I've read, but the ancient gauntlets I've only got from the Isle of Trembo. So I think you can only get ancient gauntlets from the Isle of Trembo. I don't think you can get it from anywhere else. So that's like the one thing. I did all these quests to see where I could find stuff. I was looking into it, trying to figure it out, trying to make it a dang near perfect system. And uh, some things... As far as what other people wrote, I think they're very close to being accurate. Almost everything's perfectly accurate, but just that one little detail. Uh, I could only find the Ancient Gauntlets in Isle of Tremble. Maybe I was supremely unlucky, but I quested for a week or two straight. Like, literally, like, all day of questing. And I'm, like, writing everything down, all the little notepads, trying to figure where everything goes. <laughs> you know? It was such a... It was such a detailed thing. It can take you a while. It can take you a long time to do it. Just saying. Um, so now we're gonna do... We're gonna go to Cold Hands. We'll do that one first. And mostly the forest with the samurai sword, where the, where the samurais can quest for. They're gonna get their samurai swords, so you know that's a good place for them. Uh, and then you go to there. I never thought I'd remember all this, but I'm surprised I actually kind of do. Kind of do. Kind of do. Okay. Kind of. <laughs> it takes a while. You have to do this a lot in order to get used to remembering half this stuff. In two weeks straight of doing it, I think I, I, I remembered a decent amount. Oh, man. That tells you something about some of the time I have sometimes. Oh, man. And you are level 10, so you should go... Well, you can go anywhere, right? But Unmapped Island actually has uh, a couple interesting rewards. I believe... I wrote it everything down. I wrote it everything down! <laughs> uh, okay. I think we're good to go.
for me the hardest part uh, to get is three star bows, easiest are dual swords, just sure coincidence, having three playthroughs. Yeah, I think the bow is in Setostora maybe, or it's in... It's either Alternia or Setostora or Jeroron. There's, there's a really good bow there. I think. I, I kind of forgot where the bows are, but... Uh, Isle of Trembo. I don't know if the Isle of Trembo does the bow. No, I don't think it. I don't think the Isle of Trembo does. All right, let's save this up quick, so everybody knows we're always playing on hard. Because right there, if I gotta circle it. People ask me, are you playing on hard? Yeah, we're playing hard. Playing hard. This one for easy was with Raging Paul. This was our, our battle there. This was the previous uh, LP we just did with Manislesi on hard. And, uh, yeah. So. You remember uh, all the shinobi locations? Ah, uh, okay. I kind of remember where most of the locations are, where items and equipment are that are really good to get for like power potions and stuff. And Morelva's, I have to say Morelva's the best. The only other place is the secret treasure trove, the secret treasure in Norzalio's capital. That's the only other place I could think of that's as comparable. But Ilvany and St. Gladi are one of the best places to go for. For the mages and for the healers. Um, I think Balutz could also be pretty good. The, um, the castle of it. The castle of which you could quest from. I don't think this is the work of a runic. We cannot lose this land to the man. Man, the system is ours. All right, knights. Dance off, bro. Me and you. Okay, I might have to make sure I have healers on these teams going forward. So I don't lose <laughs> so I don't lose my whole team here. to try to get a full elemental team so if I get some quests to get some elementals I might replace some dudes just right off the bat maybe some archers I want to see how it, I want to see how an elemental team would work I'm a little worried about. Oh, I've got ideas though. I have ideas! I have ideas, Vertigor, Altsin, everybody else is here. And even on YouTube, thanks for being here on YouTube. Want to leave some comments on YouTube? Definitely go for it. You dance to me, Oh, 
man, we can barely go anywhere here. Alright, I got a good idea. Let's do this. Coming a little bit slow here. Okay, so she's got... She has some protection here. Um, what we doing? Well, we're going to try to win this, that's for sure. We're going to soak up these uh, traps here. They're brigandine stones. We got the stones to do it, so we're going to do it. That we do. Tempt them to come and stand in a little poison anomaly all by themselves. That should be fun. We'll do a come hither move with our archer out in the front just like she is. Centaurs will... Try to send our tank, I guess. That's that's the uh, we'll, we'll give that a try. Oh good, they missed. Ah. <laughs> good, good, good. Little risky uh, with all the blue here. With Stella's team in the front like that. Little risky, but might be able to manage it. Oh, you want to come after me right now? All right. Okay. I know what we're doing for that. Oh, jeez. The blue ultimate came out the corner there. I gotta choose. I gotta pick my poison. I gotta figure out where I'm gonna go with that. Did you really come out right up at right up to Eliza just like that? Oh, but I've never seen him do it something like that before. I have not seen that. There. there. You can take the poison, little lizard guard. You you can take it all. You can have it all. <laughs> okay, I know there's the blue one there, but I think if we take out this this dragon first, we take out this the sea dragon. We're just gonna call it the new sea dragon, maybe. You know, because it's it's literally better than the normal dragon, anyways. You know, you know, you know what it is. Um, Try a bomb. Start start things off here. Maybe do a couple of shots, and then uh, Mr. Blue Dragon can, you know, wrap this up. Or maybe we'll have to level up Sylvie. Maybe we gotta do it like that. Spare wave. Oh, with a crit and a paralyze. Okay, now this paralyze makes me feel a lot more comfortable. Just doing this. Let's see what we do. I th think this would be best. This will be best. This will be best. Alright, so... Get out of range. But not get hit by a meter, Doom. Um... Probably still get hit by Meter Doom there, won't I? Okay, we're good there. Oh, is it 49? Okay, we gotta crank up the damage. Hey, Jake, how you doing? Happy Halloween. Yeah, 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 everybody, happy Halloween. Oh, man. We're already there, aren't we? We are already there. Seven! Crit, please. 
Oh, she wouldn't do it. I wanted her to crit. I didn't think about it hard enough. We almost took out that dragon there. Almost did it there. Yeah, it's going, Jake. How you doing, man? Alright, I'm trying to attack a watery woman with a red dragon on the water. Not ideal. Not ideal. Definitely not. They've got a lot of power going after her right now. Gonna have to be careful. How much power do they have coming? Got a frost spell, they've got water attack, they have so many blue attacks coming to me. Yikes. I almost like need a protect spell on her. I might have to heal her up just to just to top her off. She's gonna get hit very hard. Good, we got a hit. Yeah. Doing good. Got to get up early for decorating yard. Oh yeah. So, what are you gonna decorate it with? What could you possibly decorate the yard with? I know some people that did a lot of stuff. Somebody had a whole yard of uh, gravestones and such. I never really got the chance to do that. Yeah, I never got the chance to do that. You know? But, um, should I be worried with him? No, we're going to get revival stones anyway, so if I lose some monsters, it's, it's fine. It's not fine, but it's not the end of the world. Pumpkins, hey? Let's see here. No! No, we needed a hit. Could have haloed it too. Oh boy. Oh, crap. Oops. Man, I can't take her down right now. I she's just way too high. I should work on the other stuff here. Honestly, she's not going to go down easily. Wow. Hurt my own guys more. A lot of gravestones. Skeletons, fire, and a sweet demon costume. Holy cow. You're going all out there, hey? Increasing target's attack for a limited number of turns.
I mean, this knight could very well do a ton of damage to me. This this could, I think Scarlet Shudder might be a good opportunity for me here. I know it's not as powerful, but if I decrease this unit's attack, it won't do devastating damage to me. So I don't know how many people have used that attack, but it... it so far... So far, so good. I think we gotta go with straight up heals, though. Oh, man. I wish I would have moved him back one space. I thought he was like, need to move back one more space, but he needed. He didn't quite need that, did he? Can we get you guys over here and help out? No, we need a high centaur for that, don't we? Uh, well. Could beat this thing down. Always do. Gotta up my game and get kids, three kids to. <laughs> to what? <laughs> to what? <laughs> Trying to trying to freak out your kids, eh? Um, I think we need to come over here. I I can't get across this bridge, and I need to start I need to start hitting targets like bigger targets. This side over here, this side on my left is a is a very serious threat right now. I need to get her over here to start shooting stuff. So I decided to literally all go that way. So. I, I kind of have to do that. And I might need another healer too. Are they going to hit me with any... Oh, I don't... Yeah, I should be fine. If only. This is tricky. This is very tricky. Tricky. Oh, to piss themselves. Oh, yeah. Apparently, Twitch might <laughs> might like hide the comment. So we got one white there. We've got. Let's see. Should I do? Let's just move in here. Okay, that's fine enough. That's that's whatever. Had two last year and one just dropped the whole bag of my lawn and run. I was fun again every day. <laughs> well. Well. I guess that works. Oh boy. No! Oh no! Oh no. That's bad. That's bad. This is bad too. It's gonna be a really tough fight. A very tough fight. I don't have any cures over there. Wait, why am I already that low? Whew. Yeah, definitely post some pics. Pop it in Discord there. That should be cool. Oh my gosh, they charmed this sucker. I'm gonna kill theirs and they have a charmed one here. This this team is falling apart. Quite literally. Nothing I can do about that either. It's... Mm. 
That'll get him in five. Doesn't do me any. That doesn't do me any good. Uh, we're gonna have to do a heal. I gotta try. Oh, we get a poison. We might lose our goblin man. Very well might. I don't know if I can beat this battle with the, the composition I have right now. I'll have to think about that. Um, let's see here. I'm gonna have to focus this guy down. That means I'm losing it. I'm losing focus of this thing here too, because this thing could easily get knocked out. got to heal too. Won't matter. He'll move it back, heal it up. Jeez. I didn't think he could just move through my line like that since he's charmed, but apparently he can. Okay, she got just smoked. Got a regain there. We've got a couple things we can do with that. Man, this thing is low. Good, we got a hit. Thank God, we got a hit. We had Diana goes next, so she might be able to finish things up with some arrows and such. Should be quite convenient for me. I gotta put everything into her. She's just, she's too tanky. I gotta put every single thing into her. Every time I click it to go where I want it to go, it always goes the other way. I don't know what it is, but every time I want to click it, fire this guy up. It goes the other way. I'm like, oh, get it. Go where I wanted to go. <laughs> every single time. Every single time since I started playing this game. Okay, 162. 
Might be able to get it. If I could get her out, that would help out so much for this fight. I don't know if I should leave her vulnerable like that. It's gonna get hit once. Get hit once with one attack. She survive one attack? I think she might be able to. Punish arrow. The Punisher. Okay, should we go back? You know what? This team should probably come back and support this team over here because we have no, we have no way of really helping them out. Oh man. We're going to hit him from the back. Oh yeah, that's here too. Oh my gosh. Whew. We got to we got to save. We got to save there. Yay! <laughs> and a little save. Just a little one. Not terribly awesome, but not terribly bad either. This has Meteor Doom, so Emily, I'm gonna avoid with my Holy Elemental at the moment. At the moment. We, we got to get this guy down. He's he's going to be a problem. We can come and we can snipe that back row and hopefully take out the other one too. This is a really tough fight. All a lot of blues and I've got mostly reds. So yeah, <laughs> we're gonna have a hell of a fight here. And now this thing's in blocking my, impeding my path too. Here it comes. Yeah. Oh boy. Don't kill me, bro. Oh no. She might, she's probably dead. I, I can't stop this charm at all. I don't think I can. Hopefully the charm will fall off and I won't have to deal with it, but. Let's get rid of him. Oh, we'll get rid of him, I guess. Makasete. 
try to hold out. I don't know if it'll work, but... She's in the freaking forest, man! She's in the forest. How much accuracy do you really have there? Come on, dude. She's in the forest. It's an archer in the forest. Plus evasion against a snake which doesn't have accuracy on the land. Wow. You really, really jipped me on that one. Get rid of this dude. I gotta heal her up. She's going frontlining. She's gonna knock that, that uh, Emily out. She's gonna do it. Bye bye. Good night. Since this is the case here, we're going to go out of the blue. Hopefully take some pot shots. Yeah. Ah, we can't do that. <laughs> Are we going to get through this unscathed? Ooh, would that be awesome? This thing's setting up to do another... Oh, it can't. That's right. Oh, that's right. That's right. We are not letting you charm me from here. That is not happening today. Sorry to tell you this, but that kind of stuff doesn't work for me. Hold on. I wish I could tell, like, how, how much I actually... I got plus 20 evasion. She's... She's got 83 agilities. Squiddies for the win. I... Dude, this has been... A pretty tough fight, gotta say. No more charm. You are not that charming anymore. He could die. <laughs> he could die <laughs> out there. Let's see, one, two, three, frost spell, maybe. What do you got left? 50? Wait, you don't have enough for... Oh, it's 60 something for frost, right? Yeah, 68. Keep thinking it was 65, 68. Um. You got a full boatload of magic left, so you could 
maybe still do something, but put you there. Dude, this battle got pretty hectic. Really kind of did. Yeah, you can't win this one. I'm sorry. Sorry, bro. Can't beat it. The triggerization is real with this battle. Yeah. I'm use that word. It sounds cool. I think we're gonna have the Pegasus go out there and poke somebody with its giant horn. Man, trying to get into this defensive pocket with all these reds. <laughs> oh, it's almost a death sentence. It's, a, it's, a, it's not the greatest idea. Uh, he might die. Might die too. I gotta wait for I gotta wait for her to cast that meteor doom, and then and then I'll just swarm with my holy elementals here. Sorry, sorceress, but you're getting shot from two different angles. What are you gonna do now, huh? What? Where's your Moses now, huh? Where's your Moses now? Oh, there he is. You had your fun, but now it's done. Take that. Take that, yeah. Yeah, take that. He'll probably kill him. I think it's time to wrap this up. Punish arrow. You know, I, I want to level up the other guys first, though. Because, why not? Nice! Very, very good. Goodbye. Good day, sir. I say good day. <laughs> yeah, Sylvie for the win. Goblin power. Oh my gosh, this team is such a ragged, weird looking team, but we did it. And no loss, no loss of life, no loss of monster life. Perfect flaws win. Pretty good battle. It's a pretty good battle. I, say, I gotta say, I gotta say, I do so, say so myself. I gotta say, it's a pretty good battle there. Freya is the Pegasus. Zelaboros. <laughs> Dude. 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 That was awesome. You gotta say that was awesome. If we were playing Front Mission 3, that would be a platinum. Boom! Stamp of platinum. If not a gold, but a solid platinum, I think, from, like, just the difficulty of that. Um, see, this is where I like where it gets really complicated. This is where the difficulty lies, is these battles here, where it's like, 
Oh, it's super risky. They could have focused on Elza, and I don't know, you know, but. Got the champion medal. That's that's good. Some revival stone there. Gonna have to go get more of those. Azure scale curious. I like it. Inferno fangs. Yes. Yes, we'll need that. We just need some bows. We're gonna need some bows. We're gonna need a lot of orbs. I think I'm gonna have to go to a place where I just quest for orbs. So I can get all the orbs. And I gotta try to get some... Uh, some black hats. No, I got a brown hat, but I gotta get a black hat, you know, for my little elemental bros. I think I know I know exactly where to go for that too. Lightning claws, that could work. That'll be good. <laughs> so many seven star cutlasses. We don't need that anymore. Auric Auricalcum. See, I've always called this auriculum. Auriculum. And maybe it could be auriculum, but or calcum. I guess is the right way to say it. I've always I've always used to say it auriculum, but or calcum. I was just saying orbs, and bam, like that, just... All I gotta do is think it. Think it and say it, and it appears just magically in front of my face. This is awesome. I love the part... I love this part about this game. I can do that with this game. I can snap my fingers sometimes. Give me a Man of Miracle Monster. Just like that. Boom. I've got it. Wow. <laughs> you can go back and watch some videos, and I literally was like, I want it right now, and I click it, and bam, it was right there. Just like that. I kid you not. I kid you not. Now, it could be my own particular luck, but I don't know. It could be the game. But uh, we got some good stuff there. Take on a level 30s. Yeah, we're going to we're gonna have to grind up this team so we can get up a lot higher. That's for sure. That is for sure. So if we can get, uh, you know, some more elementals. I'd like to go in with a full boat team of elementals if I could. Optimally, I would like that. So level three with this. What can we do for you? Dancer type, did we? Oh, yeah, she's already set. You know what? I'm just going to click the assassin just so I can stop seeing the class up thing there. That gets annoying. All right. Oh my gosh. Phoenix Feller. Mobility of one. Yes. You were just saying, like, I can't find any... I can't find any bows! Where are all the bows? Well, they're... Where I find them. <laughs> Wherever I'm questing right now. It's probably a good place to go to. <laughs> you see, this week has got it. You know? I read from that Kanavacon. <laughs> <laughs> I would have ashed it up. I just saw the movie like a few weeks ago because the, the... Oh, man. Army of Darkness is one of the best movies. If you love Halloween, you love this season, watch Army of Darkness. You might be a big Evil Dead fan, but Army of Darkness is an amazing flick. Klaatu! Verata! Nick! <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I said the words. Yeah. Alright. So, yeah. Definitely watch a movie if you like uh, a, a fun Halloween comedy. It's it's uh, it's serious. It's got a serious moments, but also very comical. It's it's very good. It's very... It's, it's one of... I think it's one of uh, Bruce Campbell's best movies, honestly. I know he went on with... Uh, with the Evil Dead, and it's sort of an action, it's sort of a comedy too, and the series is pretty good too. I have to say, the series is actually pretty decent. It's definitely an adult series, but it's pretty decent, so yeah. Um, 
yeah, we gotta we gotta get some more elementals here. You know, obviously. Let's see what we can give her. We've got her with practically some of the best stuff. I, I don't know what else I can do here. Um, we could probably do not much else, really. We got blue defense, so and we got red and blue defense. So yeah, well, it's pretty good. So, a steel bow, or a steel bow, I think we'll go with a steel bow. I like to have this on because these fights, and if I'm going to go and I'm going to fight in those spots, I can put them on the spot of the trap, break the trap, and hail to the king, baby. Yeah, maybe I should end every video with that, that would, that would be, be a cool way to do it. Or maybe hail to the cowboy, baby, maybe I'll do that instead. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know which one's better, but um, do we got uh, steel bow dare? We got. Oh, why am I doing that? I could give you the steel bow. You're the better one, so you should probably get it. Let's go with. Uh... You know what? If I don't know if we're gonna get all the equipment, we'll just go for the basic. Uh basic sets here. Blue bland, blue bland. Blue bland. It's a very bland piece of equipment. Um, or a calcum. Or a calcum. We should go for maybe the dark element would be better for this one here. I gotta go find some blue hats. So I'm gonna be doing some quests to get some blue hats so we can reposition all these elementals in the final fight in a good way. I don't know how strong they're going to be. They might not be that strong, but do what we can. Here we go. Seven stars cutlass. That's one of the better swords. I think the other sword might be a little bit better. Not the blade of Randall, the other other one. Um, Argon something. I can't remember the name of it. But seven star cutlass could potentially charm the enemy, which that's fantastic. Okay. Items. Power pill. Mobility. Do I need more magic? Uh, I might. Might as well stock up all the way. Why not? Elixir of Mana. Magic pool goes up. Yes, please. I like it. Mana Potion. Yes, please. Champion Metal. This is for Lizard King. Okay. Got Revival Stones. I've got the stones to do it. I've got the stones to do it. Alright, we look pretty good there. I forgot where I sent everybody, though. Sent them all over the place, didn't I? Oh, you know what? Actually, she's level 8. We'll train and grounds her until she's 10. Okay. Forgotten Cliffs. You know what? I... Well, it might give us some good stuff. We'll see. Uh, put him through training grounds. Get him a little bit stronger. So he doesn't suck so bad.
This one just does the planes, but the... Uh, sure. Might be set a story I need to go to. Everybody! Everybody and your mother, go to Al Seymour, please. Martha, and then you... Oh, that's right! He's level 10, but I didn't level him up. Alright. I was like, why is he not... <laughs> why is he sucking? Why is he sucking? Ranger. Ranger Rick. Ranger Rick rolled... Lionel. Alright, now you can quest a little bit better. Boom. Yeah, yeah, we'll put him there. We got any uh, stragglers around here somewhere? Okay, I think we got everybody set to go. Um, now we need to move on to over here. Alright, well, if I have some extra time, how about this? If I have some extra time, I will be back on, on Tuesday, Tuesday night, and we will grind out the rest of this, or maybe some more of this, and then the next, basically next Friday, we'll wrap up the game. We'll do both end tier things, I'll have finished everything else, and wrap up the game, you know. So I think we'll probably do it something like that. Wait, elementals are the best? No one has a counter element to them now? No one has a counter element to them now. You mean they don't get dark elementals when they fight against you? Or you think the way that they play it? I don't know. I don't know, Jake. But I know if you fight against Tim or Morelva little bit of Morelva, mostly Tim. You can have a little bit of a tough time uh, with Tim with Elementals. But, maybe end game. Uh, there, there is one scenario where there's like a whole bunch of healers and bishops and cardinals with one of these fights here, so I'm going to have to be very careful with that because a bunch of holy words could literally knock out my dark Elementals if I get them going. But, um, yeah. Alright, we're going to shave her up here. That good Brazilian going. Okay, so maybe Tuesday, if I got some time, I'll probably come on. We'll do a little bit of grinding. Um, maybe next Tuesday, I'll come on. We'll play something different. I don't know what. We could try something. Um, I really want to try a Red Dead Redemption game. I have, I have that, and I, I haven't even played it yet. So. <laughs> We'll play that the next week. I was thinking about it this week, but, you know, people are kind of excited to see some, you know, uh, quest stuff. I'll, I'll probably come on later on at night, so maybe 8 or 9 o'clock on Tuesday night. And uh, Tuesday nights, if I do Tuesday nights, it might be like later nights. So, you know, late night going into early morning uh, for that kind of a stream. But, um, yeah. This is going to have to finish it for this. Uh, thanks, everybody, for being on YouTube. I hope you had a good time. Uh, please leave some likes. Subscribe. Hit the bell. Be well. All that stuff. <laughs> Whatever. Um, you know, hopefully you're doing okay. And uh, tomorrow is going to be a alternate chapter mode. So we're going to be doing alternate chapter with a couple other friends literally right now if i could just draw it on a map like i think i'm here oh no 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 no! actually i'm up here i'm up here with my stella team and i think i'm moving over here and then i'm gonna move over here and i'm just fighting one well one woman army i've got Stella and a couple monsters and uh <laughs> there you go thanks for that vertigore <laughs> we need a little sylvie uh encouragement here but I'm just going to be moving around with this. And uh, 
Raging Paul's team is, I, I think he's here, or maybe he's here. But Raging Paul is going to move around through this territory, conquer all this stuff. Uh, we've got Metallic Mike that's going to move into Shinobi territory. And it's going to move into the Rog territory. And hopefully hold and take it over while I'm just kind of messing around up here with just one army. And so we're going to see if we can get past 25,000 points. I want to get to 30,000 points. We'll see if it happens. But, you know, that's what we're going to do tomorrow for alternate chapter. And we'll be playing as the Orange Country. Playing as Orange Country, Morelva. So a slight shade, you know, lighter than this. But uh, that's all. That's a, So YouTube, this, this could be a different uh, time frame for this video. I just have to make note of this. But for Twitch, if you want to come by... You know, definitely come by Fridays and Saturday nights. We'll be playing Burgundine. But, uh, yeah, well, we'll see you then. So, thanks for being here, everybody. Have a great night. And thank you so much for the follows. And thank you so much for the subscribes. Thank you very much for the subscribe, Altison, and everybody else that did subscribe. I duly appreciate it. Um, and besides Burgundine, we're going to be doing more uh, Front Mission on Wednesdays. And then Final Fantasy will be Thursday nights. So... We're going to get through all the Final Fantasies, all the ones that we can get through, which I think I'd have to probably buy a couple of the new ones. I I never actually finished 13 yet. I never even played 13. I played almost all of them except for 13, 15, and there's the 16 coming out, so I'm like, i got to get on that too. If 16 is an online player, that would be interesting. Tactics is going to come up, but we're going to try to play it according to their time frame, so whichever one comes first, 7 or Tactics... That's what we'll probably play first. But we're on Final Fantasy 1. We've gotten through... We, we got through the Earth Cave. And uh, we're trying to do everything so we can do the Wind Cave first. And then we're going to do the Underwater Palace. And then we're going to go and fight in the Volcano. So we're going to do it in reverse order. And yes, it can be done. Um, <laughs> I've done it before. It's fun. It's a lot of fun. It's challenging. It's tough. But it can be done. A little bit of grind that goes into that, too. But, uh, yeah... That's all I've got. Thanks so much for being here. Uh, Vertigore, Jake, everybody else that popped in the chat too. I think Altison was here as well. And Untamed Carrot as well. Yeah, everybody here. And on YouTube. Thanks so much for watching as well. Uh, so we'll see you tomorrow on Twitch. Have a good night. I will tip my, tip my hat to you. Good night, everybody.